The Utica man accused of killing his grandmother and landlord back in January appeared in Oneida County Court this morning. Our Jen Selig has all the latest and spoke with defense to see where this case may be heading. In January, Nathan Aubain was charged with two counts of first degree murder for allegedly killing his 90 year old grandma, Catherine Aubain, and 78 year old landlord, Jane Wenka. Since then, the East Utica case has been put on hold in the courtroom, but a lot has happened since the day of the incident. Earlier this year, Aubain was ruled to be unfit to stand trial, but from the most recent psychological report, he is now able to act in his own defense. It has changed the case from the standpoint that we can start to move forward with it. Uh, with it. it was a quick appearance in court this morning. Aubain's attorney asked the court to adjourn this case for one week for more time to review the report. Well, we came back today because the doctors found him competent, and so after he's found competent, you basically have to restore him back into the case, and so with that, with that determination. So he came in today, that's what the court put on the record, that they had their findings. Tuzinski says he wants to speak with the doctors who did Aubain's recent psychological report. They try to see what happens, and if the if the person at the at the center ends up um, changing either attitude, behavior, that type of thing, and sometimes medication help and consistent medication helps, and that's kind of what they do. They oversee all that, and sometimes after a, peri a good period of time, you see a difference and you see a change. That's what happened here. Since last week, Aubain is being held at the Oneida County Jail. Before that, he was at the Central New York Psychiatric Center. Every uh, charge of, uh, of the indictment. We pled not guilty to at this time, and as I said, we're just looking into him a little further, and right now my focus is on the exam and whether or not uh, I want to contest it or whether or not we just want to move forward with the findings. Aubain's case was adjourned until next Wednesday, November 6th. In Utica, Jen Selig, Eyewitness News. And Aubain pleaded not guilty to five charges back in March, two of them being murder in the first degree.